on the feed, so let's get into this tea. Honey sauce is in the kitchen cooking. We about to get into Super Scent and her ex, I guess now ex, Razor. Um, She went live and basically was telling the story about what happened with her and him. <clears throat> and I do have the live, the full live. I kind of don't want to react to the full live. Oh, do I? I'm going to react to the full live because I really want y'all to get the whole point of what's going on. But um, basically, they got into an altercation. They was on a, not the highway, but like a busy road or whatever. And she said that Razor was trying to basically force her to get back in the car. What? And she felt some type of way because he basically did it in front of a lot of people. So, yeah. It's a lot with that. But, uh, okay, we are done with you. Let's get into it. What's up, y'all? So, not with me. Go back up into my life. Here we go. Oh. <coughs> Excuse me. So if he left her on the side of the road, then what? Right. I don't want y'all to mis I don't want y'all to mistake my my silence for me. Why well, ain't gonna stay silent? Cause I, I, ain't, I ain't really silent, but especially on Snapchat. But I don't want y'all to mistake for what's going on in my life as if I'm I'm um, I am distraught. I am I am going through something. I'm I'm going through something because I'm. I'm suffering a, a breakup. I'm not not only am I suffering a breakup, my kids are suffering a breakup. So it's not just about it's not just about me. I spent <coughs> almost three years with somebody, and my kids did too. So I don't want nobody to feel like, oh, you know, she's 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 going through it, and um, and she I'm going through something because I'm I'm dealing with a, a breakup that I was not expecting. So let's just get that over with. Uh -huh. Um. I got too much love and respect for Ray to get on here and 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 drag for him and make him feel like he just this whatever. But I, I I'm not gonna I'm not gonna defend the nigga neither. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna defend the nigga. I'm not gonna like lie about no nigga. I'm not gonna. The truth is the truth, and it is what it is. Like I'm not gonna be on some. Oh um, I'm taking him back. I'm still single. Mm -hmm. I'm not engaged. We're not going to act like, you know what? I ain't going to lie. What happened between us is not something. I feel like they be back together next week. No cap. But I could be wrong. Mm. For for me to pack my bags in. And it sounds like she really hurt about it to the point that she could at least have a conversation with the nigga, though. Move on uh, until somebody really takes some some type of ownership or deal with some type of consequences. The night when I was on, when I was on Snapchat, we was planning the game night. And listen, I'm I'm real big on everybody know I'm super public about about my relationship. I'm super public about what's good, what's bad. I don't really too Shopping much and hide the day after. everything. How people try to make it seem like, oh, um, you um you try to make everything look like it's glistening. No, I don't. That's not me. One 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 in that's, the chat. That's y'all face. That's not me. I don't get on here and make it seem like we don't deal with real relationship problems because we do. We we normal, we regular people, and that's fine. And also, I'm I'm a woman that's that's gonna fight a nigga. So we're not going to make it seem like, oh, a nigga just laid me down and, and, and rolled me out and I'm scared. I'm, I'm, I'm never scared of a nigga. I'm not. And ain't no nigga going to put his hands on me, but I'll be putting my hands on him. Fair. So that's just what it is. Race statement, appreciate it. Do, but realistically, you did call physical harm to me. So Ray said that he never put his hands on her, basically. I call, I call physical harm to you. When we was in a car, I had my little glasses on. I had my little glasses on, my little um, my little metal glasses that he bought me for um for Christmas. Which I've been in the bed all day. My little metal glasses that he bought me for Christmas, huh. and I I put my music on because we arguing, and I'm trying to get to a space where I'm not trying to be aggressive, uh, the the aggressor all the time. I'm <coughs> I'm known for you know fighting my boyfriend. Uh, I'm known oh. for. <laughs> so fucking super is the damn abuser. <laughs> Like, it's not funny, because I know we laugh at things when it comes to me and y'all. I'm not not saying it's funny. It's just ironic. You know what I'm saying? 
hitting somebody. But first. she didn't like, lie. I mean, she's admitting to it. Doing shit. I'm trying to. I'm. I'm trying to work on it. I'm mm. trying to be a better partner. I know. Even though, like, women don't want to be. <laughs> I know my face is saying so. So I'm my trying bad. to work on that, and I've been working on that lately. I'm not gonna lie. I've been doing a little bit better with. Not swinging on a nigga, not bopping a nigga. I've been, I've been real good with that. Not bopping I, a nigga. I, I think crazy. personally, I've, I've been real without seeking therapy. I need to seek therapy, but on my own, I've been working real good on not punching my nigga first. She thought his hand was coming her way to hit her, but he was trying to smack the glasses off or something. I've been doing good. Mm. So kudos to me. So when, he, when I had my glasses on and he tried to snatch my glasses off my face and me not looking. I felt like you hit me. Uh, and me feeling like you hit me, I snuck him back. <laughs> Damn. I ain't gonna lie. <clears throat> me and Honey Sauce got a no touch zone because any little touch will take us to the top. So we really cannot even like nothing. Nothing. Like nothing. But uh, trying to take my glasses off, I'm gonna have to fuck you up. Don't touch me. Don't don't snap. All that snatching stuff for me and all that, that's you being <laughs> aggressive with me. We said we wasn't doing that anymore. We said we was not doing anything. We not moving off emotions. We not we not being aggressive with one another. Like we didn't came to that. To yeah, that, super to that is a, is a big woman. So we not gonna put our hands on anything. We not gonna. She not ain't no little girl. So when you snatch something from me, and I felt like you hit me. I'm not, I'm not looking at you. I'm looking at the road. We in the car. I'm looking at the road, and you take my glasses off my face. So I felt like you hit me. I snuck him, knock his vanilla. Cause don't put your hands on me. Fair. Now you trying to restrain me. We on some restraining shit. And you pull over on the side of the road on the arm ramp. Cause you restraining me. I get out cause I don't want you restraining me. When I get out the car, we on the we, we on the side of the interstate. When I get out the <laughs> car, don't, don't don't bring me back to the car. Let me let me calm down. I, I'm removing myself so so I can calm down. You could calm down. We both upset right now. It could get worse. Whatever. As right. I'm walking away from the car, you drag me back to the car. Not drag you back why, to the why car. Why is you dragging me back back to the car? Now I'm not restraining. I'm not I'm not struggling with you. I'm not I, I'm not fighting you. But now you dragging me back to the car. I'm not mad that you drag me. Huh? I'm mad because you had no regard for people that could see us. You had no regard for the people that's watching. You had no regard if anybody could have pulled over, did something, somebody could have got involved. We in same time in the parish. Bitch, the, the police could have seen you. Anything could have happened. I ain't break up because we had a little scuffle. This is what we do. I broke up with you because you had no regard for us being in public and you dragged me to a car. So this is why I think they'll be back together next week. Now, granted... <clears throat> I think Mango knocking on the door. <laughs> now, if you, um, what you see? If you knock off, oh, me, I almost fall. If you try to knock off my glasses or you try to do anything to me that's physical, it's going to be a problem. What are you, what are you, that, no. Ah, what, what, what is that? What is that? Y'all, he done, I'm, it's a cheese it. Mango, how did you get to cheese it? Oh, he loved every bit of it, y'all. Baby, Mango done came in here and smashed a cheese it. He so licking the lip. No, it was on the floor. Give me this damn child. Let's go, Mango. Give me my, give me my, give me my headphones. Give me. I'm so Mango. I if you die tonight over cheese it. It's because of your mom. No, no, you just, no. I didn't do it. Y'all, he was smashing on that bitch. I don't even remember what I was talking about. I'm talking. <laughs> <laughs> mm, mm. 
Then he just going to lay on me like it ain't nothing. Because y'all know they have very sensitive stomachs. Any little piece of anything will have that nigga throwing up to them all. And he think it's cool to just bust down a cheese it and shit. Who I completely forgot it was on the floor. Oh. Lord, please let Mango live. <laughs> we are not around here feeding them cheese its and shit, okay? <clears throat> Anyhow, I forgot what I was talking about. <laughs> um I forgot. I forgot. Uh, let's pray for Mango. <laughs> I ain't know the reason why I popped the video and said Mango knew I was eating you no. Know, so I know when he knocks on the door because I feel his little paw go like shh on the door. He don't really knock. It's like a shh. So I heard it. So he's standing there. I'm like, what's up? He comes in. He instantly finds a cheese hit. How? Because I ain't know who seen us on the side of that room. It was too many people passing us on the side of the road. Anybody could have seen us. Anybody could have <laughs> took a video. They got people pulling over. Anybody could have seen us. Look at me like. That's why I put it out. And not to mention. I he looking at me like, bitch, you late. <laughs> I'm all in his mouth. It's, he's still chewing somewhere, though. Oh, sick of it. Forgot when I was on. It's plenty of times I told, I told, when I'm on live, I told y'all, when, when me and Ray get into it and every time we be on some breakup shit, Ray, Ray don't feel like it's a real breakup until it's posted. Huh? Ray used to ask me, oh, post it, because this not real, it'd be on posted. Ray wanted a public breakup. That's what he wanted. Oh. Um. That's why I made the post. I don't, I don't, I, I, I wanted to deal with my breakup privately. I feel like when we break up, you know, we could go out, we can go our separate ways and... When they come out and come out, but no, but like last time I, I I posted before I was single because he asked me to, and when I did, he started crying, huh? and I took it down. Like we not gonna act like, and I told my live this. I told live, I'm like, when we break up, you be want me to post it, and you want me to tell everybody because you feel like it's not it's not authentic until until <coughs> until we really like until it's posted. I don't, I don't want, I did that already. I don't want to do that anymore. That's why I posted so you could feel free. Not just that when we on our way home, I'm thinking you would have been you know a little. A little apologetic, a little, you know, remorseful. The whole time, the, the, the whole time we in the car, you, you mad at me as if I done you something. So now I'm like, okay, bet I can't wait till I get home. When huh? I get home, it's over for you. That's how I felt in that moment. When Ray coming back to my post of me, I didn't, I didn't say, oh Ray, <coughs> and he this, no, no. I said, let me put this tea out. I'm, I'm no longer engaged. I'm, I'm single. This and all that. We not gonna be friends because we not. Whatever, and then you double back with the calling me a bullet. Did I play on words? Yes. I should have dodged him licks. I ain't gonna lie, knocking his veneer out is crazy. Punching on me? No. I did play on words. So maybe I I I, I, I over exaggerate a little bit. But did you drag me? Did we fight? Yes. Yes. I mean let's let's be real, we did. We did. You was aggressive with me. I got aggressive back. But this is what we do. And but Here's the thing. This is what I always say, y'all. If if he never touched her glasses, he would still have his veneer. If you know you got a woman who like to fight, why the hell would you put hands on her? Why would you even put your hand that her way? So, if you kept your hands to yourself, you would have your veneer today. But since he want to snatch glasses and, and, and think he about to put on some paws, she just put his ass down. Super is an energy. Period. Oh, God, we need more supers. Jaden, Krishan, take notes. We need more supers out here in these streets. But we said we wasn't doing that anymore. That's why I was pissed off. We said we was not doing this. We we made a vow to, we are too grown. We got too much going on for us to be moving off emotions and for us to get physical because we upset. <coughs> I know that all too well. That's me. A nigga make me mad, I'm bopping him. I'm, I don't want to be that person anymore. Well, I don't, because I have to deal with repercussions if I keep hitting on the man. I, I know what I got to deal with, me putting my hands on a nigga. I got to deal with whatever come behind it. That's a fact. I don't want to deal with that. 
I'm not stronger than a man. I don't give a f about a whole saying I'm bigger, I'm taller. I'm not stronger than a f man. Back. Ain't no way you gonna sit around and say, oh, ain't no way she let that little Ray is stronger than me. Any man is stronger than me, bitch. I'm not no man. I'm gonna f that's all I am, how big I am. I am. You strong enough to knock out a whole fucking vanilla, bitch. You got something. You got some power in that bunch. You know what I'm saying? Just knock a nigga whole too fat. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. Not no man. You ain't no man. You can't physically but I be will no man. say, at least she know. You just can't. I don't know why. Act like, oh, he, he, he couldn't have. He, no, it would have made more sense to say, I, I ain't no, I, I ain't no weak hope. I ain't gonna let no nigga put their hands on me. I ain't gonna, especially without me fighting back. So that's why I, I ended my relationship. Not on some, I'm, I'm battered and I'm, I'm, I'm in this ab uh, abusive ass. No, because I felt like you ain't give a f in that moment and we said we wasn't doing it no more. This is why I think they'll be back together soon. Because he didn't care in that moment. So, she wanted him to apologize. He ain't apologized yet, for real. So, I think if he give her a genuine apology, she'll be back with him. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if he'd be I better. Got a her, whole but... lot of love and respect for Ray. A whole lot. I don't feel like Ray's a person. I don't <laughs> feel like he's an abusive person. But I do feel like he need help. He knew that was gonna I piss do. him off. That's why he snatched the glasses. I do feel like he need help. Fuck, we both need help. But he need help. He need to see somebody. He gotta work on his temper. I ain't gonna lie. She need to see somebody too. She can't just put it on him. I mean, granted, she said we both do, but nah. Nobody need to put their hands on nobody. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I done been there, done that. It's just not a good feeling. The aftermath is really not a good feeling. We all just need to keep our hands to ourselves. Real shit. If I make you mad, nothing, nothing I should say, nothing I should do should make you mad enough to reach for me. In no type of way. It ain't nothing wrong with that. We we all probably need some help, but he gotta get help. I'm mm -hmm. I'm up because of my relationship in it. <laughs> That's why I'm I'm not because I was abused. But you ended I'm the relationship because everything I put into everything I poured into this relationship is is has ended. So I just wanted to put that out there because I am a public. And I'm not, again, I'm not, I'm, I ain't asking for no privacy. It is what it is. I see a lot of people making fun of and, you know, saying some whatever. It is what it is. I don't oh, come with this. It. That's why I ain't want to do this. That's why I ain't want to do the the public breakup. That's why I said I'd rather deal with my breakup privately. So, <coughs> we just, you know, we all need some counseling. We all need some therapy. That's a fact. I definitely appreciate his, um, his post of apologizing because he knew he was wrong for that. You knew it was wrong. Bitch, I ain't no bullet. Don't play with me. <laughs> Bitch, don't play with me. And he ain't no bullet. I, I, I would never got on there and say, oh, yeah, I dodged your bullet. Because that would be a lie. That would be a lie. <clears throat> that would be a lie. Because I don't look at you as a bullet. I don't. But um, I appreciate everybody that reached out to me. Um, doing. All right, y'all. Um, it's giving super. And, um, bro, both need some help. Um, and I think that that's okay. We all do. It's a lot of shit going on and it's hard to keep this brain afloat child and, and, and stay in positivity and things like that. Um, when there's so much bullshit going on, you know what I'm saying? So much bullshit going on. So, um, I feel where she coming from, but you know, we all got to take accountability for our actions and, um, she got to do better. Period. Um, she needs to get some counseling just like him. Maybe they need to get counseling together so they could be together. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below, though. Uh, I'm done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.